yeah, it was a, a strange one, really strange game. L lots happened, a lot of um, different feelings from it at, at one nil down and a penalty down. You're fearing, fearing the worst at that moment. And Nick makes an incredible save. We then managed to get ourselves ahead and ultimately then we're disappointed not to win. Do you know what? I actually can't remember whether he pushed me or not. I've got no idea. Um, it was just such a strange thing because you're concentrating on the game. It's not something you expect to happen. Um, he confronted me, said something that I can't repeat. And then he's led away. I think that's what happened, but someone might tell me different. I'm OK, yeah. I mean, I think that moments like that do, um, do make you, you think. You know, the safety of staff, players is paramount for me at the Premier League, any matches in, in the Football League. And we need to be mindful. You know, I think security is, um, is so important. Yeah, I think maybe the longer time goes on, I think we might think that that's a really good point for us. Uh, I don't feel that now. I feel disappointed we haven't won. Um, but yeah, depends obviously what happens after and uh, in our next games, but it could be a valuable point. And I think coming here was always going to be difficult today. The situation that the Leeds are in, new manager, style of play, crowd. I think we've done OK. Uh, I think we could have played better, but... Um, yeah, it's the Premier League. It's never easy. Um, possibly. Who knows, Keith? I think it's difficult to predict anything in football. You've seen that today with what happened in the match. Um, but we're prepared for that. If it does, then you know that will be what we have to do. Front row. Uh, yeah, I don't. I don't know if I had time to be fearful. To be honest. Um, because it was over in a flash, but certainly it makes you makes you think, you know, what ifs, um, and I think it's moments like this that that should hopefully make people think and, and analyse things and see how we can improve safety for, as I say, staff and players. Well, it does if if. You know, that those types of situations, no one should have to face that, playing a sport they love and, and trying to entertain the country. No one should have to, you know, feel their own personal safety is violated. So um, it's certainly something for us to reflect on. Jacob? Thinking behind that was um, just looking at the balance of the team last week and, and looking at Leeds' threats, their direct play, and Joey knowing Joey would be in there for the majority of goal kicks and set plays. So we just decided to look at it. We tweaked it around. I mean, we changed system four or five times in that game to try and find a result and to try and find a way back in the game. So it's that's normal practice for us, I think. We're very adaptable. Um, no, it's just with the players available, trying to find the best team, the best rhythm. Um, but as I say, we're always adaptable. I'm always changing things in running. I think that's important that you have those um, attributes in your team. Martin? <laughs> Usual practice for me. I won't speak to them until later on because I'm here talking to you. So, no, I haven't. No, it's very much personal to me. So... Uh, but that, you know that's fine. You're used to it in football. I think it happens all the time. Miles, sorry. Yeah, I mean, uh, he's a player that I love. I've said many times. I thought today he showed incredible composure. Very difficult to score two penalties. Um, it didn't surprise me that he wanted to grab the second one after scoring the first. Um, but he had a long wait for that one. A lot of mind games going on. I thought he composed himself and just focused on what he needed to do. And he changed direction and went down the middle. Uh, really pleased for him with both goals. Yeah, Jacob just had a sore groin today. So um, that's why he didn't enter the pitch. Craig?
Craig, I've come straight here. Yeah. We were told the goal was onside, uh, and then so we were sort of quite adamant. I hadn't seen it. We were just told the goal was onside, and then <laughs> and then it wasn't. So uh, that was our our mistake. Kieran. Yeah, I think it certainly helped again. I think you know, I think you, you've got to leave the attacking player with a clear thought process. I think that would have helped Callum gather his thoughts without the um, the aim and intensity of the Leeds players towards him. I think there was probably a feeling of them. They didn't know who was going to take it, so it was difficult then to pinpoint um, any type of more mind games that way. So uh, very clever again from Trips. Yeah, I'm glad someone was there. Um, so I wouldn't have fancied my chances, to be honest. But uh, no, I, I, I can't. Re I didn't really see the reaction of my staff because it was just over in a blink of an eye. And then I'm back to the game, just trying to make sure we um, do our best for the remainder of the match. Yeah, I think we we have to be very positive. I think we're disappointed not to win today. I think it was a, a great chance for us with the lead and not long left in the match but we have to accept what happened um, it's still in our hands we have three huge games to come I think again we have to revert back you have sometimes have to take yourself back to the start of the season and what we would have thought to have been in this position now and um, everyone at the club would have would have taken that so it's in our hands and we have to be very positive about what's ahead Jordan Yeah, I think every time we play at home um, is an opportunity to win because of the conditions, the the arena, the support, the confidence. You know, we've done really well at home this season, so yeah, we love to play there. We go there uh, into those two games with belief that we can get the job done, but it's never that easy. Um, and it showed today because Leeds with a new manager and a style of play that's very difficult to play against and a crowd that are in the game made it a really tough match for us. I'll be watching it, yeah, but I'll be watching Leicester, preparing for that game. Martin? No? Okay. Thanks, everybody. Thank you. Thanks Cheers. very much. Thank you. Thanks.